As a ConnectWise control administrator, I can group users into roles for security purposes. In this video, I will create a new role for Tier 1 support. It will allow users to create a support session, edit the details, join, and end the session. To create a role, navigate to the administration page and select Security. Next, click Create Role. Enter a name for the role. I will enter Tier 1 Support. Next, from Global Permissions, select Create Support Session. This permission will allow the creation of a support session within any of the support session groups. Next, using Scoped Permissions, I will narrow the scope to a particular session group. These permissions consist of two columns. The left column displays all the available session groups. I can click a session group to select it. For this role, choose the group My Session. I can also select more groups by holding down the control key and clicking on each group. The right column lets me choose the permissions that will apply to the group or groups that I have selected. Select the permissions, View Session Group, which will allow users to view this session group, Join Session, in session and edit session, which will let your users join, end, and edit sessions in this group only. Then click Save Role. Now I will associate the role to a user named Art. On the security page, under the internal user sources, click Show User Table. Click Edit next to the user Art. Select the role Tier 1 Support, then click Save User. Now, when Art logs into ConnectWise Control, they can only see the support session group My Sessions. They can create a support session, edit the details, join, and end the session. That's it! This concludes the role-based security video. For more information on role-based security and more, visit our documentation site at connectwise.com slash control docs. Thanks.